Welcome to this presentation about earthing in bed. We'll show you the types of sheets, how to fit them, how to connect them, and how to lie on them to get the optimal benefits. This is the universal half sheet, which will fit any bed and goes across the end of it. This is a sheet for a single bed. It's a fitted sheet and one of a range of four. For double beds, there are a range of sheets to fit various sizes. This is the one for a standard four foot six wide double bed. This sheet, which is thicker and bigger, fits a five foot wide UK double bed. What is called the queen size in America. And this is the American King or the UK the Super King, which is for beds that are six foot wide. A question that's often asked is which sheet is better? Well, one is not necessarily better than the other, they're just different. So the half sheet anyone can use and it's the most economic option in the range. It's lightweight to travel with and you can easily connect it into adapters in different countries. The full sheet provides more contact area you might like the appearance better and the less clothes you sleep with then potentially the more effective it is. However, more important than which type of sheet you choose is that you actually have the benefits of using an earthing sheet at night. All sheets are constructed in the same way. They are all 100% GM-free cotton, and they have a network of silver fibers woven into them at nominally two by one centimeter intervals. This provides a crisscross conductive pattern to connect to the wiring system that ultimately connects the sheet and thus yourself to earth. Each sheet is available as a complete kit with two ways to connect to the main system. Our preference is to use the rod system, where you have a rod that goes into the ground outside. There is an interconnecting cable that runs from the sheet to the rod. The cable for the rod is very thin. It's only about 1.5 millimeters, and it easily goes through a window, which you can then close on it later. There is a separate installation video to explain this process. Where it is not possible or convenient to install the rod system, like in a high-rise apartment, then there is a system that connects to the earthing cabling in the house wiring. For this, you have the sheet, you have the cable that goes from the sheet, and this cable connects into a special adapter plug that you fit into the wall socket. It's an easy slide-in connection. So you connect it all up and plug it in. If you want to make sure that your mains house wiring is earthed, then there is a special tester that is available as an optional extra and will display three lights when there is a correctly configured earth. Here we've prepared the sheet for installation and Joanne is now going to hold up the sheet and connect it to the mains cable connection first and then to make sure that the connection is good contact she's going to pull the sheet towards her so that the connection part is actually under the pressure of the mattress. So here's the sheet installed fully tucked under both sides with the connecting cable run underneath the bed conveniently and plugged in to the nearest mains socket. People sleep in different positions and they change that position through the night. The important thing about the half sheet is to always maintain some body contact. So you can put it anywhere on the bed. 
Joanna likes to sleep with pyjamas, long pyjamas on, but she positions the sheet so her feet are always in contact. And it doesn't matter if you have one square centimetre or the whole of your naked body in contact with the sheet. The benefits are essentially the same. It's just the time scale of activity that changes a bit. If you sleep alone, then in a double bed or in a single bed, you can stretch out as Joanna has, or alternatively, you can put the sheet lengthwise down the bed. You may like a double bed, but sleep alone. So to get more benefit, a faster rate of exchange with the earth, you can put the sheet lengthwise down the bed. Sometimes your partner may not want to share your experience of earthing. So you can also lay the half sheet just down your side of the bed. The only difference with fitted sheets is that they cover the whole bed. They tuck in under each corner and you end up with a total surface area of your bed that is a conductive sheet. Some people like fitted sheets because they look neater or technically it means wherever you move in bed you're in contact with the earthing circuit. Here is a person that feels really cold in bed, especially in the English winters. So she's really well dressed up. She's lying on a fitted earthing sheet. However, because she has no skin in contact with it, she's getting no benefit from it. If she actually spent more time with her skin, in contact with the earthing sheet, her circulation may improve, her thyroid may behave more appropriately, and she may feel warmer in bed. Night is the time when we repair and recover. Night is the time when we're accessible, when we can receive inputs from the earth. We connect to the rhythms of the earth, which tends to stabilize our sleep cycle. So people do report sleeping better, sleeping for fewer hours, going to sleep at dark, waking up at light, and still with less sleep, having more vitality during the day. Things work better for them. They report also not waking up with so many aches and pains.